What it is, it's your boy LB with the man himself, Mr. ATL Burley. And as I said, we bring in and showing our videos here on YouTube, bringing your 52 blocks into boxing, also bringing your 52 blocks into kickboxing. That's right, I said it. I said what I said. Showing you how to merge the blocks and not only be just a fist attacker, but be a feet attacker too. You are two mm. fisted attacker. Mm. Two people attacking. You got one man upstairs, you got a man right. downstairs in the basement. He want to do some work too. So this is all easy flow. These are just showing how you can use the shapes to get them in. All easy flow. Thumbs up. So remember, as we said before, we want to make sure that we have our shoulder line. We don't want to be standing in front of the man. We don't want to be standing in front of the man trying to throw kicks <laughs> and get and see what happens. Even as I kick and he sticks his hands out, he has the leverage. So you want to make sure of that too is that you don't let your ego and aggression and wanting to hurt the man in front of you make you stand in the danger zone. So you want to make sure you're off to the side. You touch with the jab. Now I'm going to use a rear skull and bones with a leg kick. Once again, off to the side, I flash, there it is right there, and I take the shot. Back up a little bit more so they can see it. All right, so you're now using your skull and bones like a thing. Same way, off your leaves, skull and bones, and you turn it over. You can put it on the inside hip here, or use the rear skeleton bones to go for the back of the leg. Using your kick to come right behind the shape. Usually with the punch, you punch it and then you throw in the shape. But with the kick, you're going to throw the shape and then fire. Practice easy, don't hurt nobody. 